Developing news tonight, the woman stabbed at a Worcester restaurant Wednesday night has died. Police say a New Hampshire man entered O'Connor's restaurant and attacked her. It appears the two dated and had a prior history together. Well, we're also learning more about the suspect's past tonight. Our Cam Jandro is live at O'Connor's and joins us now with the details. Cam. Olivia, police confirmed 28-year-old Carlos Asensio was wanted for a home invasion earlier this year in Ayer. Police say he allegedly attacked his ex-girlfriend, the same woman who was stabbed and killed in the O'Connor's parking lot last night. Police arrested him in this parking lot, and it was thanks to the help of some good bystanders. Police say the two had previously dated. Alan Corson Jr., a customer in the restaurant, jumped into action and attempted to help the woman. The 26-year-old was also stabbed during the struggle, but his injuries are non-life-threatening. He recounts the moments leading up to the incident. I thought he was beating her up, a man beating up a woman. And um, so I grabbed for the arms, and um, one of the men say, hey, I have one of the knives. And um, that's actually the first time I had known he had a knife. And... Um, as I'm down on the ground with the guy, you know, I just feel this, you know, sensation in my hip or on well, my side, my left side. And um, it turns out, you know, while wrestling to the ground, he had gotten me inside. In a statement on their Facebook page, O'Connor's Restaurant and Bar says, As you all have probably heard by now, there was a shocking and traumatic event in our restaurant, our home last night. Our condolences are with the victim and her family. We are overwhelmingly grateful to the police, our guests, and our staff who valiantly responded to help her and apprehend the assailant. Now, police are yet to release the identity of the 31-year-old victim. Asensio is being held on multiple charges, including murder. We're live in Worcester tonight. I'm Cam Jandro, Worcester News Tonight.